Hi everyone, it's Brittany and Katie with the QT team in Rochester, New York. We are talking about a market shift today. What? what? So we are starting to see things shift a little bit. I mean, that's not to make everyone think that there is- Don't get super hopeful. Right, there's nothing necessarily <laughs> insanely like crazy going on, but we are seeing a slight shift. We're seeing some houses make it through delayed negotiations with no offers. Some houses get lower activity. Um, things are looking a little bit different in the real estate world. So like, what does that yeah, mean what does that as mean? a buyer or a seller? Okay, so let's talk about buyers first. Buyers have- been trained that there's going to be 70 showings on every listing. There's going to be offers. Yep, you're going to be up against like 25, 30 people. It's going to go insanely over the list price. And that is what we've been seeing for quite a while now. Yes. Um, however, with this little shift that we've seen in the past few weeks, offer or uh, houses are making it past delay negotiations with no offers. So what does that Stop. mean for yeah. right. <laughs> what does that mean for buyers that have looked at that house? They might be able to get it for the list price. Right. Um, or close to it. Or uh shoot. Oh or if they've if the um if something has made it past delay negotiations and they still don't get offers within the next few days we're seeing price, uh, adjustments. price adjustments which right. I mean we have a little field in the MLS to like how many price adjustments were there today and for a very long time that has read zero <laughs> for every hour of the day. Yes. Um, so now we're starting to see those trickle in as well. So it's, I, I'm going to say it, it's getting a little bit easier for some buyers and some price points, um, but it is by no means easy. Yeah, right. And we're still seeing, I mean, some houses in the very popular areas, ones that are very updated, move and ready. I mean, there's still a lot of houses that are getting a lot of activity, a lot of offers. So that's not to say that like, you're going to enter the market tomorrow and every house you look at, you're going to be up yeah. against minimal people because that's not the case, but there are certain houses, certain circumstances, certain areas, you know, all of that kind of stuff is kind of, we're just starting to see, and we've, we're seeing it across the country in other markets. There has been, you know, a shift that's happened sooner. So that's maybe where we're seeing things happen. We're calling it the weirdness. Yes. The weirdness <laughs> that is happening. We are in this weird in between stage right now. Okay. So now for sellers, what mm -hmm. does that mean for me? I'm you know, used to hearing that it's this crazy seller's market and I'm going to make a lot of money on my house and I'm not going to have to put in a lot of work. So what are we telling our sellers? Right. So the number one most important thing is like hiring the right person mm -hmm. that understands this market, understands how to price in this market. That has been, That's I think, important. the biggest thing right now in this weirdness is knowing what the market's doing in the area that you're looking to sell and how to price appropriately so that you aren't ending up with minimal offers mm -hmm. or low activity. Or low activity yeah. um, and then the marketing, right? We're, we're going back to the basics now. Before, I mean, you could put a house, even if it wasn't, I mean, granted, you probably left a lot of money on the table, but mm -hmm. even if you threw up a house with cell phone picture or something, it was still likely going to sell. For what price? Who knows, but it was still likely going to sell. The marketing is huge now. So important. Professional pictures are more important than ever. Um, staging tips, mm -hmm. following your agent's advice, um, cleaning up and just mm -hmm. making sure that the house is tidy tidy yeah. and decluttered and showing in the best light is more important now than it has been in the past couple of years. Yeah, and we do, we have a marketing team here that does all of the, you know, target marketing and all the, basically making sure that we're getting in front of the largest audience and we're mm -hmm. finding that buyer that's the right fit for you. Um, if we start to continue to see this market shifting, huge. Mm -hmm. So make sure that you are up to date with the knowledge of what's happening in this market and how to approach it if you are a buyer, if you are a seller, and that's what we're here for to help you through that. And if you have any other additional questions that we didn't hit on in this video about the shift, um, rumors that you might have heard about the shift or what it means going forward, reach out. We're happy to answer any questions.